So now I'm just laying down while the train passes. I know typically they don't have engineers in the in the final cars, but hey, it's always good for a little snooze, right? Hey guys, what's up? It's Last Adventurer, and we're gonna be checking out two abandoned railroad towers today. Right now I'm up here at MG Tower, then we're gonna go up to AR, help them out a little more. But yeah, there's a train coming, so as soon as that thing goes by, we're going over. All right, train just went by, so we're gonna run over to this tower. This thing is super old. I think it was built sometime in the 40s. An old analog switch tower for the railroad. Obviously these aren't used anymore. So it was actually kind of funny how I originally found this place back when I was in high school. Oh geez, probably like going on 10 years ago. Holy crap. I had this little Honda Ruckus scooter and uh, there was a Gamelands Road that I checked out on it. And I drove up it and I saw this and I was like, dang, this is cool. So I've known about this place for quite some time, but over the years I've seen it deteriorate more and more but we'll go inside the first room here. So we got a nice toilet in there. <laughs> All kinds of random junk in here. It smells really musty in here. I'm not sure what this was right here. Maybe some sort of like heater or something. It's this brick Flintex it says on it. I hear another train coming up from down the way. And this is just the first tower we're exploring. There's another one called AR. And by the way, this is called MG Tower, and that stands for mid-grade. <laughs> we'll get some of this graffiti on here. I like that. It's hurdle. Clown down there. Just clowning around. And then you got this part right here. Um, my friend climbed up there before. And that crazy mofo actually used these old window sills to climb up there. And he said there was a desk and stuff up there. But these are incredibly unstable, so I won't be climbing up there. And right here, these were actually stairs that have all collapsed. These stairs went the whole way up there. You know, it sucks because up there, it's probably the most intact. Because people don't really go up there. But this is where all the switches were. I don't know what that is. All the switches are right here. Oh, shoot. Okay, that is not stable to stand on. But you can see some of them are, some of the stuff is still here. Old radiator. So the way me and my friend, well, my friend got up there was we stacked a bunch of stuff right here one night. He climbed onto that roof right there and he went in through a window up there. I think. I mean, I, I did say that he climbed up on the windowsill, so I can't remember. Maybe he climbed down that way. Okay, I'm gonna go in here. Something's blocking it. What is that? Yeah, something fell down in here. It's blocking the entrance. All right, so I was able to push it out of the way, but there is the most stuff in here. Check this out. Got a whole table of stuff right here. But uh, <laughs> imagine just chilling here, looking out these windows. Like, how cool would that be? What is this? Hornet and wasp killer. And we got more wasp and hornet killer. Wonder which one's better, wasp and hornet or hornet and wasp? You know, a lot of people always ask me why I like doing this stuff. And, well, being in stuff that's abandoned, it's like stepping back in time. It's like a time capsule. But, uh, I think there might be a train coming by, so I'm gonna try to get a video out the window here. So there's a train coming down the mountain, up from the glitz and tunnels. We're gonna get a shot of it. to AR Tower, just up the mountain. Probably a little more snowy. Super cool though. I'm excited for you guys to see it. Down there is the tower. We're gonna take a uh, dirt road and go to it. And my last video, 
the Glitzen Tunnel was actually down there. So you haven't seen that yet, go check it out. All right, so uh, waiting for this train over here to go past and then we're gonna go over to the tower. All right guys, made it to the tower. Train's still going by, but the engines are way up ahead, so we're good. Let's go inside and check this thing out. This is AR Tower. So this is the first little building. I'm not sure exactly what it was, but there's some stuff in here. Check this out. Fuse box, a bunch of more old stuff. Similar to the last one, but like I said, the main building has three floors, so it's super cool. All right, let's go inside the main building now. There's upstairs. We'll go in here first. Check out the first floor. Why is there so many cans of whipped cream and butter in here? Look at that. Butter, whipped cream. I'm assuming they were used for storage. Some railroad worker probably really liked whipped cream and butter. Or Cool Whip, my bad. All right, so now we'll go down into the basement. The door just like, is falling down here. That's cool. Old fashioned steps. So look at that. An old feather. Not much left behind in these lockers. I'm not being super loud because there's people on the other side of the rails. I think they're just rail fans. So they probably won't do anything, but if they say something, I'll be friendly with them. What's this? Anti freeze. There's the, well, I guess there still is. There's steps to go out. You know, there's a second way to get into the basement. We'll go upstairs now, though. You know, this train's actually providing excellent cover to the other side of the rails. Actually, I think this is a different train. I'm confused, I'm disoriented right now. We're going upstairs. I think these steps are like metal, that's interesting. Look at the walls too. The walls are concrete, reinforced with steel, looks like. Steel door, wow. This is it, guys. You get an amazing view up here. I think these might have been the switches. I'm not sure. I don't know a lot about trains. I know a little bit, but uh, it's pretty cool. Hey, look, spring break bloom, buddy. I, I love when people do like cool little graffitis like that. Yeah, I think the, uh, the other people were across the rails right there. I'm over that way somewhere, parked behind the <laughs> behind a hillside, so I'm not seeing. Yeah, this is really cool. This right here, this has been AR Tower. And obviously we checked out MG as well. What's this little closet right here? Bagman. This little closet right here. That's cool. So now I'm just laying down while the train passes. I know typically they don't have engineers in the, in the final cars, but hey, it's always good for a little snooze, right? So when that train passed by, I got to talking to the guy that was on the other side of the rails. Anyway, he comes to tell me that when he was growing up, there used to be people up here, they're just kind of like wave at you and stuff. I'm assuming workers. But he told me in the basement, there was a kitchen and a bed. And then on the first floor, there was like a living room type area with like a TV and stuff. And that those people here, they just kind of lived here. I'm assuming they were workers, but I'm not 100% sure. But uh, yeah, it's been MG at AR Tower. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And as always, it's been real. It's been me. It's been a last adventure.